Today, on February 17, residents of Delhi and surrounding areas woke up to a sharp reminder of the region's seismic vulnerability. A magnitude 4.0 earthquake hit early this morning, sending shockwaves through Delhi, Ghaziabad, Noida and Gurugram. The tremors were strong enough to force people out of their homes as the city experienced the kind of shaking that many said they have never felt before. But why is North India, especially Delhi, is so prone to such earthquakes? Let's explore the science and geography behind it. At around 5.30 in the morning, a 4.0 magnitude earthquake struck the region with its epicenter located near Dholakua in Delhi. The tremors were felt across the national capital region, causing panic in the residential areas and even affecting railway stations where some passengers mistook the vibration for an approaching train. The National Centre for Seismology reported that the earthquake occurred at a depth of just 5 kilometres, amplifying the intensity of the shake. In response, Prime Minister Narendra Modi reassured residents to stay calm and adhere to safety protocols, with authorities monitoring the situation closely for any aftershocks. North India and Delhi in particular are located in a seismic zone that has long been a hotbed for tectonic activities. Geographically, Delhi lies in Seismic Zone 4, a region that is highly susceptible to earthquakes. This zone is one of the more earthquake-prone regions in India, with seismic risk that extends to several major cities like Noida, Ghaziabad and Gurugram. Now let's understand why this happens. Delhi is situated in Seismic Zone 4, which signifies a high risk of earthquakes. The Delhi Disaster Management Authority, or DDMA, classifies this region as one that experiences seismic activities typically ranging from magnitude 5 to 6. However, earthquakes of magnitude 7 or even 8 are also a possibility. The implications of being in this zone are significant. For example, in the case of an earthquake with a magnitude of 6.5, more than 85% of buildings in Delhi could experience moderate damage. That's a sobering statistics, especially given the city's dense population and aging infrastructure. The Earth's crust is divided into several large and small slabs of solid rock called tectonic plates. These plates are constantly moving, albeit very slowly. When plates shift, they cause tension and eventually release energy, resulting in earthquakes. Now India, North India lies at the meeting point of Indian and Eurasian tectonic plates. Over millions of years, the Indian plates have been colliding with the Eurasian plates, causing tremendous pressure to build up. When this energy is released, it caused the kind of seismic activity we see today in North India. Geology plays a key role in why Delhi feels these tremors. The seismic activity here is linked to the Delhi Hardwar Ridge, a major geological structure that extends beneath the alluvial plain of the Ganga Basin and into the Himalayas. This ridge coincides with the extension of the Aravali mountain range, contributing to the region's vulnerability. The tectonic stress from the collision of plates is further amplified by this geological setup, which not only makes earthquake possible, but also intense when they occur. Delhi's history with earthquake is not a new phenomenon. In fact, the city has been rocked by significant tremors for centuries. Since 1720, at least five earthquakes of magnitude 5.5 or higher on the richer scale have hit the region. While the city's seismic activity is often moderate, powerful tremors are not unusual. In 2020 alone, there were several notable quakes with magnitudes above 3.0, followed by multiple aftershocks. The proximity of Delhi to the active Himalayan belt makes it prone to such events. While Delhi is aware of its seismic risks, there are several challenges when it comes to preparedness. Many buildings in the city are not earthquake resistant, and the population density in certain areas makes evacuation difficult. The National Disaster Management Authority, or NDMA, has found that many of the city's structure, especially older buildings, do not meet modern seismic safety standards. This increases the vulnerability of the city during an earthquake, especially in a region that sees such frequent tremors. 
Though Delhi is vulnerable, it's not without its safeguards. Authorities continuously monitor seismic activities and the DDMA has emergency plans in place. However, if large earthquake were to strike, the consequences could go beyond just casualties. With its importance as the political and commercial hub of India, the economic and political fallout would be enormous. That's why experts continue to emphasize the importance of earthquake-resistant infrastructure, improved evacuation system and public awareness to mitigate disaster impact. So now we know why Delhi and the surrounding NCR region are so prone to earthquakes. What steps you think the city should take to better prepare for these tremors? Let us know the thoughts in the comments below. Stay safe, stay alert and remember, preparedness can make all the difference in case of an earthquake.